Before we address the subject of overlap and alignments, it would be helpful to understand the type of offense teams run based on the number of setters. There are three basic offenses. 4-2, where the setter comes from the front row. 6-2, where the setters come out of the back row. 5-1, the setter is always the same player. The 5-1 offense is probably used the most. The key to making sure the team is in their proper position usually lies with the position of the setter and who is opposite at the moment the serve is contacted. The positions are numbered and named. Number one, right back. Number two, right front. Number three, center front. Number four, left front. Number five, left back. Number six, center back. Players shall be in correct order with no overlapping of adjacent players front to back and side to side. The position of the player is determined by the player's foot relative to the adjacent player. A front row player must have a part of the foot closer to the center line than the corresponding back row player. A right side player must have a part of the foot closer to the right side line than the part of the foot of the corresponding row of the center player. Players may move prior to the serve, but must be in their correct position when the serve is contacted. After the serve is contacted, players may move from their respective positions. Overlaps occur for a variety of reasons, some of which are they enhance the team passing facilitate setter and hitter transitions. They disguise modes of attack. The gray areas of the rules can be applied to issue a warning or a caution when a potential overlap exists. At no time, however, should an overlap be ignored. Just be 105% sure before an overlap is called. Undoubtedly, the coach will inquire who was overlapped, so be ready to give the players numbers and, if necessary, a brief reason. There's so much more that could be demonstrated. A future video will be dedicated solely to alignments and overlaps. Now, let's move on to the general duties of the referee and the umpire.